What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here. Ladies and gentlemen, we are now nine days away from the release of Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. And today we got some amazing information on how we're gonna be able to preload the game tomorrow, a free weapons pack for those who pre-order the game and so much more. So if you have pre-ordered Black Ops Cold War, then you're gonna be getting two free weapon blueprints available the very second you start the game, regardless if you're on Xbox, PS4, or PC. And yes, this also includes the next-gen console. So again, once you first start up the game, you'll be able to play as Sergeant Frank Woods. And then once the Create a Class menu is unlocked, the Confrontation Weapons Pack will also be available for you as well. The first weapon on the left is the AK-47, but the blueprint is called the Iron Curtain, and it's based on an iconic Soviet heavy-hitting weapon. And the other blueprint for the M16 is called the Western Front, a three-round burst tactical rifle with plenty of patriotic flair. And both blueprints will include five pre-configured attachments, allowing you to experiment with these attachments before they are unlocked organically on that specific weapon. And again, this is only available for those who pre-order the game, so if you haven't yet, go ahead and do so, because there are a plethora of free content and advantages that come with doing so. One of these advantages are being able to preload the game early. Now, preloading is going to be available for the PS4 and Xbox One tomorrow, November the 5th, at 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. But then for the PC, preloading is going to be available on the 10th of November. But for the time, it's going to be available starting at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. And you're probably wondering, why will PC be five days later than consoles? Well, it's to try and stop those data miners from digging around in the files, spoiling parts of the campaign, and maybe even the zombie Easter egg, stuff like that. So if you don't want to be spoiled and want to dive headfirst unaware of what to expect, Honestly, I would stay away from places like Reddit, maybe Twitter as well. I definitely am not gonna be covering any spoilers like that, so you don't gotta worry about that from me, but we'd only be a few days away from the release of the game, so I don't expect anything major to come out, but I mean, hey, you never really know with data miners and uh, that type of content. Now, for the next-gen consoles, preloading is gonna be available on their respective launch days for both the Xbox Series S and X, November the 10th, and then on the 12th for the PS5, so, Keep in mind, if you're expecting a next-gen console to come in the mail, or you're picking one up, especially for those who are getting the PS5, you're cutting it a little bit close to release day, um, but still, you know, you do have some time. Now, if you purchase the digital version of the game, then preloading for the game is gonna start automatically onto your console. Um, say if you purchase on the PS4 or Xbox Live Store, then again, the game is gonna automatically appear in your downloads right at 9 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So you don't gotta enter in some code or dig around any menu inside of the console. Again, it's gonna automatically appear inside of your downloads. However, if it does not download automatically, you either wanna search up the game in the store again, and there could be a download option. You wanna press that too but also make sure your console is updated to its most recent download. And then of course, be sure you have enough space to download the full game. On PC, Black Ops Cold War can be found under the partner games in the battle.net launcher. But speaking of download sizes, for the PlayStation 4, it's coming in at 95 gigs. For the PS5, it's 133 gigs. The Xbox One, 93 gigs. Xbox Series X and S, 136 gigs. And then of course though, on PlayStation, Xbox, and PC, players can also have the option to uninstall game modes that they don't want to have on their console in order to save space on their platform. So for example, say if you plan on just playing strictly multiplayer zombies in Warzone, then you can choose to not install the campaign packs onto your console. Again, to just save space for you know future updates and other content like that, maybe for other games as well. So yeah guys, this is all the information we have coming uh, for Black Ops Cold War about download sizes, preloading, etc. Again, the game's gonna be coming out next week on November the 13th. I am super duper excited. Expect some amazing videos coming out for me later this month as well. Again, my giveaway too is also gonna be happening on that day. If you guys haven't seen any information about that, be sure to watch the video down below in the description because it's gonna give you some more information about how to get a free copy of Black Ops Cold War and an Elgato HD 60S capture card. So with that, guys, please say your thoughts about this down below in the comments. I love you all so, so much. Have a great rest of the day. Till next time, I'll see you guys later.